Okay, another development. Um, looks like we're going to the Florida Keys. What do you think, Naftali? Have you ever been to the Keys? <laughs> nope. <laughs> So, as it turns out, uh, Lake Okeechobee is up two feet. That means this boat would have to be basically tipped over. And at that point, it would be too wide to get through. Um, we're not going to do it. The cards aren't lining up in our favor. It's time to head south. So, that'll add a, a bit of distance and time to our travel. A $20 million question is how long until we know how fast the boat will move. Eh, who knows? So, plan B. We are going to take it out first thing tomorrow morning as planned and start heading to the south and sail 24 hours a day. Two different shifts. I will sail with Danny and Naftali will be sailing with George. Three or four hour shift, something like that. And we'll see how far we can progress in a day. Worst case scenario, we think we're going to go down to Miami. Uh, best case scenario, we may be, we're going to cut through at Marathon. Uh, Marathon Island is in the Florida Keys. Um, so we'll cut through there and join the intercoastal and head up the Gulf side. So the best case scenario, if we can get, say, 120 miles a day, heck, if we can get George to push his flight back one day, we can get home or almost home. And if almost home, find a, a transitory parking uh, somewhere up there. So... Unfortunately, there will not be a tipping video heading your way. Are we sad about no tipping video? A little bit. Like I said, I think we were all kind of excited about the notion, but I think we all uh, had a fair amount of trepidation, and George is the only one to have really vocalized it much so far. So I imagine he's going to be much more happy uh, to hear that we have an alternative plan in place. Even without the tipping video, uh, you still have four guys on a boat They've never sailed before, and only one of the four of us is really much of a sailor to start out with. So there should still be plenty of adventure. Uh, Am I that one? You are that one. Oh, <laughs> wow. Uh, Naftali's experience, are, are we talking something in the 50, 60 foot class? Yes, and quite a bit on a 30 footer. <laughs> <laughs> the 50 foot class would be a catamaran. The 30 foot would be his boat. <laughs> All right, well. I guess this is the last update for tonight. Now that we have a new plan in action, we'll see you at Dark 30 tomorrow.